listen, you already know what time it is, man. It's that boy Deadly back out here with another video. As y'all can see by the title of today. Today we will be ranking rap albums that dropped in 2023 on the tier list, man. Listen, I'm not sure if tier lists are even still popular. Are people still doing tier lists, bro? Y'all let me know down below in the comments. But even if they not, we still gonna do it, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I might make this a yearly thing, like with all the videos I made this year, with the favorite artists of 2023 underground rap albums of the year and mainstream rap albums of the year. I might start making that shit like a main thing every single year but hey man let's get into it all right man here we go with the shit right here man rap slash hip-hop albums the 2023 updated tier list maker now thing is i had to go in here and add the albums that wasn't on here that i listened to the last time he updated this shit was like in june or july so i had to add the remainder that dropped this year for example the albums that dropped in december november i had to add all those plus i added some underground albums that i put on my list in the underground in my top 10 underground albums of the year video so y'all can go watch that video but hey man let's get into it bro as you can see we have the ones i haven't bumped yet ass ass all right decent five that shit five and then we got album of the year so album of the year i might end up putting a few i don't know we gonna see let's get into it bro. haven't bumped let's just get the ones i haven't heard out the way let me just get all the stuff that i don't know what they are out the way and i'll come back now i moved majority of the ones i haven't heard all of these will be down here the ones i haven't bumped yet i'm glad that he added this part right here because it's definitely some albums i haven't heard this year and i guess this is my boy who that made it so hey man appreciate you no cap but i did end up coming in clutch and adding some so young thugs album uh i'll put that at c the only reason i'm putting that at c is because if you compare his shit to Gunna's album, Thug was in jail when he released it and Gunna was out of jail. So that album was pre-made. It's not like he made those songs and made it into an album. Those are just some songs that he, that his management put together to drop an album. So that's why I put that at C. It wasn't bad though. All right, Kenny Mason 6. This wasn't even an album, but listen, no cap. No cap. We can't put this at album of the year because it's not an album. Uh, Key Glocks, I'll put that at C. Gunna's. Mm, that might this might end up changing y'all this might end up changing yeet you shit was hard uh i'll put it at b for right now almost healed almost healed it can go to a b uh yeah Young Nudy album will go at an S for sure. I fuck with Nudy heavy. This Go Plus shit by Sofego wasn't even an album it was a mixtape but hey we'll take it i'll put it at an a uh, actually i'll put it at a b we can slide this up slide this up yeah yeah that's better that's better that's better mansion music i almost forgot about this that dropped this year yo mansion music actually dropped this year i forgot about that but mansion music i'll put that i follow with mansion music there's a lot of people that didn't mess with mansion music at all i'll put it at b all right ray shrimmer shrim life what is this four uh i'll put that at no, it's five. I, I'll give it a B. I'll give it a B. I'll give it a B. If Lisk could kill, we'll sit it at S for now. Love Sick, that was an S for me. Uh, Tyler, the Creator, this album really came out in 2022, y'all, but I guess he ended up dropping like a deluxe for it. I reacted to it, but didn't that reaction get blocked or something? Yeah, it got blocked. That reaction got blocked. So I might have to put this at F. I'm just <laughs> <laughs> the album, if we're talking about that album, it was cool. I'll give it a I'll give it a A. NBA Young Boy. I heard it, but I didn't hear enough of it. So I'm gonna put it at. I'm not really a young boy fan, y'all. I'll put it at F. Fuck it. It's like nah. That's 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 hating. That's hating. I'll put it at D. Uzi Pink Tape. That's obviously going to S. This Jack Harlow album. Haven't heard it. Whatever. Oh, this uh the other young boy album, I think. I haven't heard it. I don't know what this is. I haven't heard it. Lil Yachty. I put shit at the S. A Great Chaos by Ken Carson. I put that at an S. This is a deluxe for uh Destroy Lonely. So we can put the deluxe up here and then take this down. Midnight Club. Did I add Midnight Club in here? But we can put that. I really think Midnight Club, it, it was an A album for me. And listen, all of this stuff is my opinion. So if y'all get mad, make your own list. Like, come on now. Ganger, I did replay it a little bit. It's an A album for me. Now, BK the Ruler. Let me think. I got to think about this one. The only songs that I have downloaded from level five, it's probably like two, three songs. I'll give it a B. Now, before we get into Fifth Amendment, let's do Snot or Not. So Snot or Not, I'll give that an A. Now, Fifth Amendment, I'll give that an S. Uh, y'all want to know why? I done said it two times 
times in the video because Mishi was on the hooks, y'all. All right, 101 by Hard Rock. Shit, that is going at S tier, man. You know what? You know what? Revenants was a B for me. Celestial, that was an S. Summer's album, I didn't listen to it for real. Lancey Fox. Let me see. If we take a look at B, did I enjoy Lancey Fox album more than shit that's on here? I definitely did. I'll give it an A. But I feel like A is a little bit too high, so I put it at B. Tony Snow, his album was five. I put it at a B. Summer's Mind by Babyface Ray. I put that at an A. This is Rich and Mary Ghetto Fabulous. So I would put that at A for sure. That was really an S album from, from him, not gonna lie. If y'all really think about it, that was a W album from him, bruh. Sex, Money, Drugs by Lucky. No, no, that's an S. That's an S. That's an S. I fuck with that album heavy. Utopia. Realistically, it's a F. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm putting it at A because at first I didn't fuck with it. And then after a few listens, I ended up fucking with it. So, Tizo Touchdown, How Do You Sleep at Night? That is obviously an S, y'all. Come on now. If you haven't heard that album, make sure y'all go check it out. Golden Child, Chapter 3 by Autumn. I'll put that in the a tech by Lil Tecca, that's a s transitions the album is a whole song it's a s the last song transitions to the first song he's the only artist to do that this year trippy red a love letter to you five i'll put that at a Nicki minaj her album was s drake <laughs> drake i'll put it at a this might end up changing y'all so quavos was an s paris texas midair that's an S. And the last one we have, which is right here, is DC to Don Funeral. DC to Don Funeral shit was hard. I ain't gonna lie. Would I put it at an S? No. I put it at an A. And let's see if I need to change anything, y'all. Hmm. Now, it might be some people in the comments that might be like, oh, how is this an S? But you had albums that was higher on your list for your end of the year. Albums of 2023 videos for underground and mainstream. Listen, it all varies. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. It all varies, y'all. Out of all of these albums right here, we gotta pick an underground album of the year and mainstream album of the year. Or I might just do multiple for real. Albums of the year that could have been an album of the year for me. I would go Tizo Touchdown for sure. Destroy Long Lee. Ken Carson, Uzi, Tekka, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Let me let me make sure. This shit looking kind of solid right now. There's no albums that I haven't actually actually i lied i lied i lied y'all hold on give me a second all right man and we're back i just added two more albums i added pistols and pearls by kodak black and i also added when i was dead by kodak black now listen y'all if it's a few albums that i'm missing i'm sorry there's a lot of albums that dropped this year so i apologize goddamn but it ain't my fault for real pistols and pearls personally it's a d I don't even want it that far on the list though. I don't even want it that far up because the thing that ruined that album for me, y'all, is the fact that he had songs where it was just the features and not him on it. And he put it early in the album. And I literally skipped those songs. And that kind of ruined the album for me. So I, that's why I'm putting that at F. Even though it did have a few songs on there that was hard, but I haven't went back to the album. So that's tough. When I Was Dead. That was a W beat, by the way. Mmm. I put it out of C. This is how I'm feeling right now. Albums of the year. How do you sleep at night? If Liz could kill. A great chaos. Pink tape. Tech. That's how I'm feeling. But hey, man, let me know what y'all think about my tier list down below in the comments. I will leave the link to the tier list. Hopefully I can like save it. I'm not sure if I could take this like with all these albums and make my own. But if I can, then I'll do it. If I can't, then other than that, man, hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you can like us, comment, and subscribe if you know you feel me. I haven't missed the date uploading in December. I ended up getting sick and everything, bro. I'm still recovering right now, but listen had to get the content out for y'all appreciate y'all for all the love y'all gave me this year man 10k on the way 10k on the way 10k on the way y'all already know what time it is man it's, it's me your boy that boy deli oh i gone man